So today's game is going to bring out one of my worst fears, and that is being a girl. That would terrify me. So let's jump in and uh, <laughs> see what that's like. What's up, guys and gals? Welcome to the Outer Middle Show. Mad Vlad is the name, and the stalked is the game. And in today's episode, don't really know much on the backstory. All I know is that we're a girl, and we're going to get stalked. I'm not going to say anything else. We're just going to jump in. I had to break up with Liam, and I hope he takes it well. Oh my god, it's, this is already starting off bad. Thank you, game, for putting a space to continue the dialogue. Because normally games, they don't put dialogue up long enough to read. Because I suck at reading. This crib is dizzle dope, brah. It's so shizzy in here. Yeah, so, I need to make some food. I'm hungry. Yeah, you just internally farted. Yeah, this is, this is nice. I like this. Square footage, you know, questionable. Then this room is a little weird, a little cramped, but uh, nice floors. Nice high-rise ceilings, beams, bedroom. This is like an open floor plan, sort of, kind of. Very modern. Very modern. I don't know about that. That's kind of stupid. I'm just checking the place out. Ooh, a balcony. Open, please. I ran into the glass. You didn't see that. This is an apartment. This is one of those upscale apartments in a big city. I couldn't do it. I hate heights. I would never go out on that balcony. Okay. Well, let's get something to eat then. We need a pan, which needs replacing. Why would we have a pan like that in a house like this? A rusty pan. Where's the hex clad at? Okay. There we go. Got the fire. I don't know why we're putting fire to that just yet. Let's see what's in the fridge. Uh, uh or we're gonna eat some organic food in a from a can in a. I'm not going to question it. Wow. Dude, what? Dude, why can't food be that easy? Who would be knocking on my door at this hour? Probably Liam. Liam, I'm not interested anymore. And that front door does not match. Uh, Who's there? Oh, God. It's Liam. Hey, honey. Can I come in? Uh, Liam, I told you it's over. So, no. You can't come in. Come on. You can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. Oh, no, Liam. Come on, bro. Just shake it off, man. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Open the door, Kate. Uh, No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. Dang. This, this is, like, really straightforward. But heartbreaking. Because I've been in that position before. And it sucks. You will be mine again soon. Now, I haven't been in that position. I've never done that. That's creepy. Okay. Um, sounds like he walked away. Thank God. Uh, close the, this door. Put a chain on it. All right. I'm wondering if there's multiple endings. Oh, crap. My food. My uh, sausage and carrot jubilee. You're just going to eat it out of the frying pan? Like This chick is gangster. A bath to calm myself down a bit would be great right now. Oh, no. I better be careful. <laughs> mm. Bath? Wait, I didn't see a bathroom. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, bro. Look at this laboratory. Beautiful. I'm probably going to get the hiccup. Ups, yep, got the hiccups. I ate, I ate too much. 
Ah. Excuse me. Okay, uh, so we've got a dedicated shower room. Sort of. Uh, dedicated shower... What in the hell was that? Oh, Liam, you idiot. Give me another chance, please. You just threw a rock through my window. I will treat you well and do anything you want. I promise. Oh, this is bad. You know, I've never been in this position, but seeing this from a girl's position, dude, this is insane. I can't imagine. Liam, you need to go to the gym, bro. You need to let go. Uh, just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much, can it? Oh, my God. Kiss. Dude, you just bricked her window, bro. No, 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 no. I got to leave before he does something worse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How the hell did he throw a rock from down there? A rock that big? Liam must be really strong. That makes this doubly scary. Liam, you bastard! Oh my god! How did he catch me? You got caught. Try again. I, I guess. What? What am I supposed to do? Just, mm, maybe leave out the front door? Did I make it? I was gonna do a cartwheel off the balcony. How, what? Um. Yeah, you made it to the car. Calling Grandpa. Yeah, call Grandpa! P pick up the phone. Hello, Grandpa. I need help. Hey, Kate. What's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away. And now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? No, I got away before he could do something, but I'm terrified he will find me. Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while. Yes. You can come live with me. Oh, no. For as long as you need. However, I'm going to be out on a business trip for one week. Grandpa, you're not supposed to be on business. You're old. You're supposed to be my, my pappy. You're supposed to have the, the shotgun next to you. That's fine. It's still safer than staying here. Can I go there right now? Yes. I'll send you the address. You know, she don't know her grandfather's address? The key to my house is in the, the, the flower pot. That's such a grandpa move. Also, remember to keep the doors locked. And if you need to go outside, you can always check the PayPal first. Okay. Thanks, Grandpa. You're a lifesaver. No problem. I hope all goes well. And don't hesitate to call me again. And I'll blow his dick. See, that's what I would have said as a grandpa. All right. Uh, let's let's drive. We might want to hit the drive button. What the hell? Ah! It's Tony Hawk! Hit the gas, man! Oh, my God, bro. I gotta quit using these pouches while I play games like this. I almost swallowed it. That was a close call. Thank God I made it out. Yeah, you sat there on the phone long enough. You could have... <laughs> Liam won't be able to find me anymore now. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. I have finally broken free from that toxic relationship. Doesn't sound like it. You should have called the police. Uh, Where the hell does Grandpa live? He's probably holding on to the roof of the car. Or he's made his way into the trunk or something stupid is going to happen I couldn't man dude I can't imagine are you serious are you serious right when we get to the house really and what kind of house is this we got to find Papaw's shotgun You have got to be kidding me. How do you not? Dog. I have to turn your light on. Okay. Uh, flower pot. Flower pot. Flower pot. Which one? Open the damn door. 
Hey, hey, yeah, yeah. Wow, it's it's dark in here. Let's turn on some lights and find a bedroom. I want to hit the bed ASAP. You t ah, lock the door. Gee whiz, man, lock that door too. And we got a peephole. I hate this. This is god awful. Call the police, man. You had a car. Pull in behind you. You know it's him. How do you not recognize his car if you dated him? Yeah, Papa is set up, bro. Turn on some lights. It's the old light fixtures. Old light switches. Is that an outlet? Like, really? This place is gangster. Papa was a gangster. No wonder he's not home. All right, let's, uh... Okay, there's the poop room. Uh, I don't wonder why that's locked. It's weird. Uh, what is this? Light switch. Turn that on. I'm going to turn all the lights on in this house. Yeah, it's an old house. It makes a lot of weird noises. I'm terrified, dude. I can move pretty well, but I know I'm frail and beautiful. And that scares me. I need to grow a beard really quick. Where's the shotgun? Come on, man. Why? Close that door. He's got a grandfather clock, a miniature one on the wall. Anyway, I guess let's go to sleep. For whatever reason. Oh, no. Please be daytime. Oh, God. Wow, I slept that long? Yeah, you didn't sleep long enough. I'm surprised you slept at all. Wait a minute. Oh, my God, it's 3.55 p.m. <sighs> Is Grandpa home already? No, you know he's not home already. He's on a business trip. Probably selling some moved substance to some gangsters. He's that kind of papal. God, he's got a beautiful land. Did I, he's, got, he's got beautiful land, not a beautiful land. And... Uh, okay. Is that... That's my car. I ain't opening that door. Why Why would I open the door? It says check the door. You know what? Screw it. Open the door. Open the door. It won't let me unlock it. There we go. Ah, a letter. Dearest new resident of this mansion, I'm the previous owner of this mansion, and you are the person I have been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we will get along just fine. I will be watching you. Watching me? This is strange to say, and yeah, it is. I need to get going to the store before it gets dark, though. Let's be careful. Ah, oh, Grandpa's got some nice land. I just want to know what that car was pulling off. Looks like a side road. What are we driving? It kind of looks like a miniature Range Rover or something. I don't know. Let's go to the store, I guess. Get some food. He's probably going to be in my car, dude. Oh, we drove with our eyes closed. That's cool. We've got a convenience store out here. Uh, what's that? Some kind of paper. Huh? Check out the paper. Well, what? Okay. A uh, poster has been added to your collection. Wow, it's creepy how similar she looks to, looks to me. Okay, right mouse bumper to switch sides. Ashley missing since 5-8-2013. Please help us bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistance could make all the difference. This is horrible. I hope they find her. Okay, awesome. Press tab to look at the shopping list. See what we need. Canned food. Yeah, we definitely need some canned food. That stuff's good. Snacks, soda, milk, cereal, wine. Awesome. Excuse me. Ah! Stranger. Oh, hi there. Haven't seen you here before. Are you new? Yes, just moved in. Where do you live? What? <sighs> yeah. Why would he ask that? I don't feel comfortable telling you that. 
Are you alone? Oh my god. Do girls go through this, man? I'm in a hurry. Sorry, gotta go. You stupid bastard. What is your problem, man? I'm I'm just gonna be very timid around women now. I'm just gonna be like, oh, you okay? <laughs> I don't know, man. Shit weirds me out, dog. Alright, well, let's get this awesome meatballs and stuff. Some chips. Soda pop. Yeah, you better leave. Gotta have some cola, right? We're on a diet. Cola diet. Alright, we got some milk with calcium in it. We got some cereal with cacao. I don't like this, man. I really don't like this. What else do we need? We need wine. Uh, do you have any hard liquor, sir? Wait a minute. Aren't you the same guy? No, you've got a freaking ponytail on your chin, bro. You are super manly. Give me that wine. All right, let's go pay. Huh, hello, is that all? Yes. All right, the total is twenty-two fifty. Yeah, that would have been about two hundred dollars where I live. Thank you for shopping here. Also, uh, I can tell you are new to the area. How long are you staying for? Uh, no problem. I'm not sure yet. Not too long, I would assume. All right. Have a good day. Here are your groceries. Thanks. You too. Yeah, whatever. Let's get out of here. Right, they got the same cars. Yeah! Holy shit! Oh, fuck. Yeah, You know, a young, beautiful lady like you shouldn't be out all alone like this. Why the... Why would you... Ah! What do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. Yeah, they, they probably should. Or I'm going to call the dude with a ponytail in there to come out of here and snap your ears off. Be careful. Don't let me catch you all alone again. Oh, my God. Uh, I don't need your warnings. Respect my space and stay away. Oh my god. This game affirms my fears. Reaff reaffirms, or wh whatever you want to call it. Let's not forget the groceries in the... C yeah, let's not. Let's turn on our flashlight. There you go. Wow, they just shot... Why is... Did, did I not close... I probably didn't close the door. That was really dumb of me. I do that all the time. Shut up. Alright, I, I know. Okay, you don't have to leave a comment. You probably already have. I left the door wide open. I do that at my house, too. Hey, I'm just making sure. I don't think I've been in the kitchen yet. Where where the hell is the kitchen? Why is that light off? Turn that light on. And why is the ambience like that? We'll lock the door. There we go. Maybe I shouldn't lock the door. There's probably somebody in here. Oh, that door was just... Oh, that's the that's the side door. Yeah, gonna keep that locked. Papa, where's the... Oh, the kitchen's in here. Wow, that's weird. I thought it was just the dining room. Well, all right. Well, got some supplies. All the bare essentials. Papa don't have anything in here, man. <laughs> no, come on, man. Unknown number. You're welcome. Great. Great. He looked beautiful in the stone. My God. <sighs> Can't wait to see you again. Getting closer. Oh my God. Door won't budge. Side door. Get me out of this house. I'd rather run. I'm soon there. Or what if I'm already there? I'm gonna die. I hate this so much. I'm knocking on the door.
You bastard. What do I do? What do I do? Dude, call the police. Please. God, man. Hey, let's open the door. Screw it. Right? That's another letter. Dear new resident, congratulations. I can't even read. Congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There's no escape from becoming mine. This is getting out of hand. I need to drive away and call the police force too late. Yeah, 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 close the door. Lock it. Yes, just get in your car, call the police, drive to the police station. Oh no. Come on. Something is really wrong. I have to get inside and call the cops, like, right now. Dude, you should have done that the second you left, you stupid, stupid person. I am crapping myself right now. 911 dispatcher, what's your emergency? Hi, I need help. I've been receiving threatening messages, letters, and texts. I'm really scared. I'm here to help you. Can you please provide your location? I'm at blah, 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 blah. It's urgent. I understand. I'm dispatch officer to your location right, right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me, following me. The messages are getting more intense. Please hurry. Stay on the line with me. Help is on the way. In the meantime, try to find a safe place, secure location within your home. Lock the doors. Or, I thought I locked the doors. Doors are locked. Doors are locked. Make sure you lock the doors. The officer should be there soon. There's another door. There's another door outside. I did lock the doors. Okay, yes, they're locked. Please hurry. That freaked me out for a second. Thought Papaw had like a secret way in or something. Why can't Papaw be home? Why? Help us on the way. Stay strong. I'm here with you until the officers arrive. I don't know where to hide. Is there like a... Maybe I can crawl under the bed. No. God, I hate this creaky floor. Where do I hide? The power's out, man. Papaw's got to have a gun in here. What kind of Papaw would he be? Maybe it's a different country. I don't know. I'm just going to stay right here. Help us on the way. Stay strong. Yeah, 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 yeah. Someone just tried to open the door. Officer would be there any second now. I can't turn off my flashlight. Yes. Yes. It appears that everything is under control now. Officers apprehended a man in a white van outside your residence. I'm not unlocking the door. Okay. Uh... We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to reach out if something... Uh, come on, man. Ah, that... Dude, you have to talk to the officer. I don't want to be here. Wow, that was so stupid. That was so dumb. Phew, what a relief. I never thought that I'd be safe again, but maybe things can get back to normal now. No. Your power is off. Your power's off. Let's go ahead and debate. What? Let's head to the basement. Outside and restore the power. Are you dumb? What? What? You have to get to the basement from the outside? Dog. I'd rather take my chances with Liam. It's already... Oh. And get a hotel. This is so dumb. Okay. Alright. Why is the... P 
Farrow should be back on now. Uh, maybe I should start reading it like that, man, because that's how I feel right now. That that one, just leave that open. Don't chain it or nothing, you know. Just turn the power off again. Ah, uh, get me in here. I left the door open again. That was smart, wasn't it? It stinks of sweat. I I no, I stink of sweat. I can't read, dude. My brain is gone. Yeah, let's take a bath. Sure. Yeah, let's just get, get all relaxed and stuff on the bottom floor after leaving the door open twice. I, I can't deal with this. I can't. I still don't know how Liam got in the damn house. Now you're naked. Finally, a moment of peace. So gullible, man. You're naked. Now you're screwed. But why would that stranger go so far from me? Whatever, it's over now. You see what I mean? No, it's not over. Yeah, did you hear that? That was the camera. I'm so exhausted. I'm hearing things now. Just like... <laughs> Let's just go to bed. It's exhausting, man. This is so exhausting. Oh, God. Ah, there you go. Let's just go to bed. There you go. Just sleep it off. The dude's in the house. Without a doubt. I left the door open twice. What is that noise? Probably somebody beating their wood on the wall. Sounds like it's coming from the storage room. And where would that be? Oh, I know where it's at. Good old storage room. Oh my god, dude. I should probably call to check how Liam's doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. Uh, what? If I had just stayed with Liam, he would have kept me safe. Is, is this the thought? You know what? I'm not, I'm not even going to go there. I'm not even going to go there. No. I make, I'm calling the shots. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind on something else. But first, let's make sure the house is empty. I still don't feel safe. You're doing that now? Now. You're doing it now. Like, I don't get it. I don't understand it. Yeah, let's check this room. Something looks off about that book. Oh, does it? You notice that. I'm getting itchy all over, dude. Like, more so than normal. Oh. Aha! Yes, Papal's secret room. Perfect. Maybe he hid the shotguns here. What the hell is this? A sudden disappearance. Ashley's whereabouts are unknown. 27 year old Ashley was reported missing on August 15, 2013, by her husband, two days after she disappeared from their home. Last seen in their residence, Ashley, su Ashley sudden, sudden absence has raised suspicion. With her husband emerging as a prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation. While authorities continue to search for leads, they urge anyone with information to come forward and assist in the search for Ashley. She was last seen here. Look, honey, we made the news. Pretty cool, right? Ah, uh, man. Come on, dude. Is Papaw weird? What is this? Ah, I can't replace you, Ashley. There is no one that is as special as you. Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My fault. How is this my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no options. What the fuck did I do? How am I going to live without you? What is the point of all this? I'm typing to a dead person. I would do anything to get you back. 
Yo, what? Dude, this is... Oh, oh, oh fuck. Arf, char, smarf. Am I dreaming? I swear, that is you. She looks just like you. Have you come back to me ten years later? Oh, no. Oh, no. That was written in 2023, bro. She is just as beautiful as you. She has to become mine. She will, no matter what. I can't let her run away from me like you did, like you once did. Um, so, uh, where is, where is Papaw? Where, where's Papaw? Is this Pap? What the hell is this? It's locked. Bro, I am I'm so confused. Maybe the dude that ran at me? I don't know. I've got so many questions. What's in this box? What's in the box? Oh, human skull. Cool. Uh, why would you want to leave me? I have done nothing but be good to you. Whatever. It doesn't matter anymore. You are never leaving me again. That's that's great. It's probably about time I talk to Grandpa about what's going on here. This is crazy. Yeah, please call that dude. Why did it turn red in here? He was married. There's the ring. He's got some explaining to do. Grandpa, are you there? Yes, has something happened? A lot has been happening. I received creepy letters and I've been followed by someone. I don't think it's Liam. I called the police and they arrested a suspect, uh, suspect, suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains some uh, psychotic things, to say the least. What? This is insane. Maybe the police arrested the guy leaving the letters? And a hidden room. I've lived there for 10 years and never seen that. I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming home ASAP. I can't stand not being able to help you. I'd like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? It makes me so uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person you brought to the... Brought this, bought this place from. So wait a minute, he bought it ten years ago. I don't know, man. Uh, that could definitely be the case. I remember that his wife had recently gone missing without a trace. It, it was the talk of the town for quite a while. And his name, and my battery died. <sighs> my phone ran out of battery, and I didn't have time to bring my charger with me. You didn't pay attention to that. Let's go. Find a flashlight in case I need one later. I think I remember seeing one in the basement. Oh, cool. Let's go back to the basement. Still daytime. Why is everything fuzzy? I'm probably stressed out. Probably a little stressed out here. Car won't start. Like, this is terrible. This is god-awful. You know, I'd rather watch a movie like this than play it. What does that sound? Well, we found one. Cool beans. Hopefully it's not one of those... I can't deal with this game. I'm going to run completely out of adrenaline and start drooling on myself. Yeah. Hmm. That crow, huh? Let's turn that off, just in case. I left the front door open again. I do that all the time. Shut up. All right, I'm I'm a I'm a girl and a dude at the same time. All right, it's hard. It's hard. I should search for a weapon just in case. Let's start by looking through Grandpa's office upstairs. That would have been the first thing I would have done, man. We gotta find Papa's shotgun. The twelve buck of Rooney. Where is it? Well, I wouldn't fit in here. Can I crouch? No. There is nothing of use in here. There's chips. Maybe you can hit him with a bag of chips. And there goes the door again. That has to be Grandpa, right? No, he's on a business trip, dude. He wouldn't make it home that fast. How can you be that stupid? And of course... Ah! Hi, sorry if I scared you. I just had to come clean out something. Or what? Clean about something. I had to come clean about something. I can't, dude, my brain is gone. Hi, sorry if I scared you. I just had to come clean about something. 
Of course you did. You are the creep that talked to me earlier outside the convenience store. What do you want to come clean about? I know I was creepy, but I w it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it in hopes that you would take him back to feel safe. How did he know I was here? I was supposed to take it a step further now, but I couldn't do it. I felt too sorry for you. <sighs> it all makes a lot more sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course. I'm sorry again. Wow. Wow. Then who did they arrest? Oh, it's night time. What? <sighs> now Liam's going to show up. Fantastic. Fantastic. Oh, my God. Really? It's night already? Yeah, you was looking out the peephole for like six hours, stupid. You have no gun. I hate the floors in this house. Turn the damn light on. Where's the, where's the gun? I want it. It's got to be a book with a secret arsenal or safe that's got bazookas and explosives and C4 and machine guns there's got to be something here because if that was the case I'd just lie in bed I'd put the rifle next to me pointing at the door and I'd just wait I'd get me a bag of chips probably watch some goonies or something I might try to entice him by getting you know unclothed I'd put the gun under the blanket I'd be complete and then it'd boom and it'd be easy I could relax wouldn't have to do any crazy stuff It'd be, it'd be great. Yeah, I'm probably going to need that too. Papal, where is your gun, dog? And what am I supposed to do? It says go to bed. I, <laughs> Bro, there's no way I'd sleep. There's no way. It would be impossible. Did that come from the bedroom door? Probably. Oh my god. You thought this was over. You feel helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work. Your phone is dead. The police think they got the person behind this. And you don't know where I am. There is nothing that you can stop me. <laughs> there is nothing that can stop me anymore. What do I do? I don't know. If I follow down the other path I saw when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbors that can help me. Bro, you have got problems. Hey, take your time. You know, no rush. I don't care to leave the door open now. I don't care. We're going to be going down the other path, and I... Wait a minute, what is that? Can't tell. He's going to start chasing me, I know it. Yep, I'm hearing stuff. My God. Stop it. Flashlight. Maybe I should turn the flashlight off. Take his car. Take his car. This is definitely Liam's car. Take it! I don't I don't know where I'm going. I'm literally just Oh, there's a there's a wall there. We can't go that way. Yeah, can't go that way either. Oh, there's a door here. Flashlight. What in the hell is this? Is this the secret cave? I didn't close the door. I don't care. Blood. Follow it. There's the girl. I think. Who is that? She is mine. What? Th that's Liam. What happened to you? No, you? Damn it, didn't let me read it. And only mine. She is mine and only mine. 
Press shift to sprint. Oh, I'm sprinting. And what is this? Yep, there's what's her name. I think these are Ashley's remains. What a sick and twisted individual her husband is. I don't even want to know uh, what he would do to me. Up the ladder we go, dog. Is there anything else I can grab? Maybe a a tank. A tank would be nice. Maybe a grenade. <laughs> Cashier, hey. Uh, I couldn't wait anymore. You need to know. My new Ashley. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Oh, no. So, it was you who has been sending the letters. I know I look similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care. How you look is more than enough. Come here. I have been waiting for this for so long. And no, I have to run before it's too late. Oh my fucking god! Oh god, okay, Liam, I'll take you back! I'll take you back, Liam, dog. I hear police. Oh my god, my sphincter is gone. It does not exist anymore. Shotgun, shoot him! The police arrived on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. He hurried back home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realized that Kate was nowhere to be seen... He got a sinking gut feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly, and they made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? <sighs> Grandpa saved the day, man. The man in the white van, uh, that his reasoning for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realized their mistake and that he had actually been telling the truth. He was released the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife Ashley, Liam, and almost Kate ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. He killed Liam? That was Liam. Yeah, I think that was Liam that was dead down in the cave. Oh, wow. Okay. that. So, Grandpa lived in a house where there was a secret that, that was formerly owned by a psychopathic killer. He's a businessman, so he always travels. He didn't notice the strange book on the shelf in the secret room. And then there was that cave. It was just wide open. Nobody just bothered to go down there. Yeah, so Liam died. But Liam was a psychopath too, man. Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult. At night, she often hears those daunting knocks on her bedroom door, disturbing her attempts to sleep throughout. Every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. Dude, that would have been from the get-go. Straight up. What an intense game this was, man. Holy crap. Uh, a live stream on Twitch on uh, sometimes Friday, sometimes Saturday. Check me out there. Uh, <laughs> leave me a like and you can subscribe if you want. I don't care. I love you. I'll see you in the next one.